Knowledge is a very big subject, there's a lot to know, but I would say ignorance is an even bigger subject. Now, it's important that we think about ignorance correctly in this way because there's different kinds of ignorance. There's low-quality ignorance and high-quality ignorance. There's not such good stuff and much better stuff. And the not-so-good ignorance, of course, is what I'm not interested in talking about tonight. Uh, Natalia will take care of that later, I'm quite sure. <laughs> um, but I'd rather talk about ignorance, the better quality, the better kind of ignorance. What James Clerk Maxwell, perhaps the greatest physicist between Newton and Einstein said about um, discovery that the thoroughly conscious ignorance is the prelude to every real discovery in science, every real advance. That's the idea of thoroughly conscious ignorance, not just something you don't know or some lack, but a thoroughly conscious kind of ignorance. I think it's also wrapped up in a phrase from um, Professor Curie, who upon gaining her second graduate degree, so she knew quite a bit, wrote in a letter to her brother that one never notices what has been done, one only can see what remains to be done, because science is about what remains to be done.